The look on her face said it all. New York One captured live the moment that Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez realized she accomplished what many thought impossible, beating out 10-time incumbent Congressman Joe Crowley. I was in shock. It was the House Democratic primary for District 14, which covers parts of the Bronx and Queens. Census numbers show the population is nearly half Hispanic, very different from when Crowley went to office 20 years ago. He was a congressional mainstay, a potential successor to House Minority Leader Nancy Pelosi. But he proved no match for the 28-year-old first-time candidate. Ocasio-Cortez ran much of her now historic campaign while working as a bartender at Flats Fix in Union Square. How were you able to do it? It was really grassroots organizing. We knocked on doors that had never been knocked on before. We knew that if we talked to people that had never been engaged or like invited to the electorate, that, you know, maybe they would show up. Political experts say she may be a novice, but she ran a spirited campaign against an opponent who took winning for granted, especially considering she was outspent 18 to 1. I think we're entering the era of authenticity and we're entering the era of the every person who can rise up and do something like this. They also point to her viral video. I wasn't born to a wealthy or powerful family. Where she spoke about her Bronx upbringing. It gets the themes right. It's shot beautifully. In her Parkchester neighborhood. I'm so happy. We need somebody fierce like that. A woman. For his part, Crowley was gracious in defeat, saying he looks forward to supporting Ocasio-Cortez in November. She does have to win the general election, but in this heavily Democratic district, she's considered the favorite. In the Bronx, Andrea Grimes, CBS 2 News. Ow.